Hello guys and welcome to the channel and uh, today in this video we are going to discuss about EFK stack which is uh, basically Elasticsearch, Fluentd and Kibana. So we will discuss what is EFK stack, how we can use, how we can set it up on our system or a cloud, uh, why it is used and why we should use it in our application or projects. So in this video we will only discuss about what EFK is and in the next videos we will see how we can install it on our local machine or either on the cloud so let's get started Dang. so what is elastic search so elastic search is a search engine based on a distributed data storage now what this data is it is your logs in the JSON format which are coming from your device or a machine. So let's consider a scenario where you have 10 machines installed at a remote site and uh, they are doing some job like calculating something or doing some transaction or, or rest of the stuff. So these machines are also saving logs side by side and we all know logs plays a very important role in any application or project. So now let's say one of the machine starts reporting wrong data. So what normally we do is we log into the machine, uh, we connect to it using any remote connections like TeamViewer or any other software. Then we download its log files and then spend some time to understand the logs to check why the machine has started reporting the wrong data. Now just imagine how much time we have spent just to analyze your logs. So here we need something which can automatically tell us or, or something like a dashboard kind of a thing where we can see our logs and can immediately identify the issue. So rather than wasting time in analyzing the logs, we can spend time in rectifying the issues. So this is where all the EFK stacks comes into the picture. So Elasticsearch is our one platform where we save all our logs. Now to push all the logs from the remote machine to the Elastic, we need Fluentd. So you can consider Fluentd like a postman which helps us in sending all the data from machine to Elastic. Now let's talk about Kibana. Kibana is used to visualize your data which is logs so using kibana we can create dashboard for all of our logs so let's say we want to monitor the temperature so we can easily create a dashboard for it which can display the values of the current temperature or previous 10 values of the temperature so in this way this all efk helps us in our application to debug it very easily and this is why it is very important to have efk set up either on a local machine or on a cloud so I guess that's all for this video. In the next video, we will set up Elastic and Kibana and Fluentd and then we will use a Python application. We'll generate few logs and then we'll push these logs to Elastic. So thank you for watching this video. Please like, share, subscribe and comment if you have any questions.